Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, well, the piece we played was, what was it, African jazz? Yeah, yeah African he just, jazz. African jazz. Um, our director, Mr. Borgo, he yeah. just did, he just African, taught a, a course, course on African, African music. Yeah, something like that. So, yeah. he, took some, he took some cool songs from African yeah. jazz and had us play, which was really fun. Yeah, yeah, and so. then we took a few modern songs as well and combined them together. Basically, well, not combined yeah. them, but played them separately and yeah. kind of. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and did, we, made, yeah. we did a jumble of a bunch of yeah. modern songs and African songs, and it was fun. Yeah. What inspires you to, to improvise? Um, well, he makes it sound very fun and makes you very confident of yourself to play it, and just yeah, they basically tell you go out and have fun. And don't <laughs> worry about making stupid mistakes. Because stupid mistakes good. are good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. usually good. It bad. Fits. Yeah, it yeah. fits perfectly. So. Yeah. So don't worry about making mistakes. So generally, that helps ease or helps gain your confidence. Yeah. yeah. A lot on your confidence side. What was your favorite part of jazz camp this week? Um, I really like the composition class yeah. actually. Um, just because. Yes. You know, even though I may not be interested in composing just jazz and other music, I still learned a lot of how to compose in the process of it and. Um, I think we all learned a lot from that class, and that was yeah, really a really fun class. We learned a lot of master classes class. as well. Over yeah, master yeah, class is another one where you learn how to yeah. play your instrument. Which and is teach good. you how to do cool notes like flutter to and all that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and like do weird sounds. Yeah, yeah. like totally animal sounds. You learn sounds and, yes. fun techniques. Interesting sounds you would usually not hear in music. <laughs> yeah. They always seem to Except for jazz. jazz. Yeah. yeah. Do you have any favorite jazz musicians? Um, <laughs> I I love Bernard Ferguson. He's, I just yeah. think his skills on the trumpet are like amazing, and mm -hmm. I don't know how he gets those notes. And it's just amazing to see him in person and to hear him. Um, and I like some of the classics too. Herbie Hancock. Um, I love Charlie Parker. Yeah. I love his yeah. sound. Charlie yeah, Parker. Yeah. 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 Um, I mean. Just you just can't say there's a favorite. Because, yeah. I mean, like, everybody. All of them, they just yeah. seem amazing what they do. <laughs> They're all uh, their it's own. It's hard to choose. <laughs> they all yeah. have their own beautifulness in them. <laughs> <laughs> They're all special, unique. They're all yeah, unique, cool. That's They're all yeah. my favorite. What advice do you have for future uh, jazz camp attendees? Um, have fun. Don't stress out about it. And try out as many things as you can, especially in jam sessions. You may be like, oh, no, I'm going to do horrible. But if you try out, you'll find out you'll have great loads of fun. <laughs> yeah. You will be like, oh my gosh, that's fun. Even if you're, at first you're like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Yeah. As soon as you do it, you're like, you relax and you mm -hmm. start to get, it also helps you in your improvising skills. So it's very good to get into these jam sessions and start <laughs> playing some jazz. The jam sessions, I think, are kind of important because, yeah. <laughs> like, at first I was really, well, I was really avoiding the jam sessions because I was freaking out. Oh my gosh! All these people are watching me. I'm really bad at this and that. But once you once you actually go out and play mm. with a bunch of other people, you really start to gain your confidence. And the next time you do it, you're much more comfortable with what yes. you're doing. Definitely. So yeah. definitely. you really, even if you're nervous the first time, just play anyway, and you won't be nerv as as nervous the second time, mm -hmm. which is definitely a nice thought. <laughs> <laughs> How are you guys going to continue your jazz study? Um, my dad is a musician, so I'm just going to have him teach me a whole bunch of stuff. He's a j specialist in jazz, so I'm going to have him teach me and maybe some other jazz activities I can play. I'll try to, you know, I know a lot of people who have jazz bands. Maybe just join one and, yeah. you know, see what I can have fun messing around with. There's a, well, there's a jazz band at the school, but it's there's, there's no improvisation or anything. <laughs> but what I'd like to do is I'm going to continue doing that, and then I'm going to I might ask my director and see if I can try and just play something in improvisation and maybe keep practicing that at home. Mm -hmm. and, yeah, and get a recording of like a rhythm section or something and then just play that and practice improvising so I keep my own improvising skills from this camp. Because I think what we learn here, I want to take with me. Mm, definitely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You learn a it's lot. Valuable. <laughs>